Cooley Boss channel. You already know what the fuck going on. You already know. You did. Cooley <laughs> channel dropping new music on his channel. You know. Got that MBK shit. OG Bad. New you know. World. <coughs> new World. You did. Hey, you know. Long live Don Chardino. I read you did. Talk your shit. You know. Y'all niggas just smoke on gas. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all niggas smoke the gas. I probably go lay down on some fire shit later. Stoop. Stupid fire, check out the um SoundCloud page. You dig? Uh damn. Young Cooley Space N W E at SoundCloud.com. Fuck your shit. Go check it out. New new motherfucking um I got some new shit up there. A little sample of something. It's called Unbreakable. You, you know, did? y'all go check that joint out. You dig? You know, you know me. MBK I'm shit. Coming with the, I'm coming with the shits. M6K. M6K. You did. Real shit. I ain't speak none of that bullshit. This these is Boss Sky Live. Like, you say what? You I said? ain't speak none of that bullshit that these rappers talking about. You did. This, this shit I don't speak. You know, this about the struggle. This, this about how to come up from the struggle, you know. We done came a long way from the bullshit. You did? You know, y'all need to sit on that bullshit. Y'all need to stop <coughs> that shit, man. Everybody want to kill everybody. Now, I might talk about killing the nigga. But that's it, he fucking with my family. Or Talk 20, you did. It's, it's, it's different ways. Yeah, it's principles to this shit. I ain't going to kill no nigga over 30 bucks. I ain't going to kill no nigga because he done dissed me in the song. Hmm. Nah, fuck all that shit. You keep on dissing. Go ahead and get my motherfucking um, ratings up. Got them. <laughs> <laughs> tell them, tell them, Flo, you man. Your, 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 your channel on the way. Yeah. You in the mix right now. <laughs> Young cool boss man, you know. Young Ooh. Cooley boss man, you dig? Ain't no more none of that other shit. It's, it's just Young Cooley like boss that. man. Too many people got the name Young Cooley, so the, the name is gonna be boss man. B O S M A N. You dig? Sauce, <laughs> sauce. Boss y'all lie two point oh man. You already know it. Hey, that's the bro, the Young Cooley man, boss man. You understand what I'm saying? You dig? You dig? But I want to talk, make this video, and <coughs> I want a bro that got you know. Throw his plugs up in there and stuff like that. I probably go do too much editing of this video. I just want to speak what's on my mind and want to speak what's on his mind, whatever, like that. So I can get whatever y'all need to get. Wherever you at in the world, good morning, good night, good evening. You know. You did. You did. You did. You did. But like he was just saying, man, hey, this boss got a lot of 2.0. Share, share, share. Like, like, like. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Y'all see me on Twitter. Nola underscore 504 underscore. Y'all see me on uh. IG Basquiat underscore Yeremiah and um Facebook is a B B E E Basquiat Orleans. And you can find that stuff and then like then in all my videos. So you can find me very easy. You did what I'm saying? Yeah. You did. But this video <laughs> go to like Young Dolph and Yo Gotti and the homie. Um G Money. G Money and uh NBA Young Boy, man. You know what I'm saying? Long live uh, G-Money. You know what I'm saying? That shit's senseless. But through the whole circus of the young dog shooting, just to get y'all some like just to catch up, let, let some of y'all catch up if you've been hiding under the rock. But all the beef came about when Dolph said that he was taking claim to be the king of Memphis. And if you, you follow hip hop, a lot of people already know Gotti already was in like he the king of Memphis. And Gotti been the king of Memphis for a minute. After three six step down and you know let him <coughs> get that lane. Even he had to fight for that too. So that's probably what it was too in the mix of that. So Gotti was taking shots at Dolph on Twitter. Yeah. Dolph didn't worry about it. Black youngster jumped in it. Yeah. Start taking shots at Dolph too. So that's when the man then actually to, took a hundred shots at Dolph. Actually, a hundred shots. At actually, a hundred at you the motherfucking uh at his Mercedes on his Mercedes Sprinter. The uh, little he van, ripped the van that he did it with. So black youngster boy, and put it in his name. That was in his stupid. Name, like, that was stupid. Stupid. You feel me? Stupid. But a hey, money talk bullshit. Walk. Well, you know these people want. He out. You what I'm saying. He <laughs> out. Right. He out. No charges was filed. No charges. Oh, that's this one. No charges was filed. And uh, and um, you know how that go. So I'm just catching y'all up a little bit, you know. And then, Dolph starts 
doing his shots back, what any man supposed to do, you getting yeah. shots at yeah. you, you're supposed to take your shots back. You know what I'm saying? So he took his little shots back. Things escalated through the months and years, whatever like that. You know, you, you, you know the power thing and the pride thing, powerful thing. You know what I'm saying? And it's always like what our people... Death is like when we die, it's like entertainment. When they die, when other people die, it's like it's big news. Big and news. It's, it's you know what I'm hor- <laughs> this was a horrible, tragic moment for history. Like, they, right, hey, right. Look. but crazy. when we die, uh, they right, were yeah. stupid. They right. Well, they said he had local news. This t- Woody Woman. Local news type shit. Yeah. Local news type shit. And then we ain't heard about it no more. <laughs> we, we bring it back up our damn selves. They ain't bringing us back up. They'll bring back up motherfucker who died ten years ago just because he was white. Right. Facts over something you had to do with something that was black. Yeah. They when white people, though, I said like it, it's, it's a big discussion in the uh, conscious communities. Like, is the white man is really the devil? Because all white people don't have those characteristics and. Most European or white people in America, but what the Bible speaks about that you have to go by the bloodline. So that this America way to keep y'all dumb fighting each other when a man is lighter and the man is darker, but you can't understand you looking at a man. But let's go with this topic: Long Little G Money and and that whole little situation with G Money and. NBA young boy got love for both of them young little brothers. They out here doing their thing. NBA out here working hard. You dig what I'm saying? He putting out this good music and he's standing on his grizzly. You feel what I'm saying? And them little dudes was friends. You know what I'm saying? Them little dudes was friends from their hometown. And I guess grew apart from the money. From the money getting better and people getting more recognition than the other. I don't really know the whole background like that. I already had to check in with, with the home team. You did. And they could fill me in with all that, but just by looking at it, I can tell it's senseless and it's stupid. But may it, but it may be deeper than what I think, but it's still senseless and stupid because it's all we see when they make the big dollars off of us. You dig what I'm saying? And where's the OGs and the big homies in these situations for Dolph and Gotti and for G Money and NBA Young Boy? Where's where's the higher speaking? You know, most logical and the people with sense around them. You dig what I'm saying? Oh yeah. But we forgot people love drama and bullshit. So you know, this is this is like hip hop turned into a, like a like a gospel do whatever for views type vibe type shit. Not all the hip hop, but majority of it always wins. You did. So who's the level headed person in these dudes corner letting them know this shit is senseless? Y'all taking care of a lot of people and there's a lot of money at stake of what y'all doing. You dig what I'm saying? Like, it seems like the big homies out here and the OGs out here don't got no nuts no more. Like, y'all don't have that. Like, y'all scared to talk to these dudes? Y'all scared to mention anything to them? And, like, you only you only speaking what's right. And I'm not knocking the people who did. Probably mothers and cousins and all different other people. Like, they close friends and shit. Probably like, come on, I'm saying this shit stupid. And, you know, I know when I was young, I didn't think of things more clearly. You know, and right. And you know what I mean? I was stuck in my own way, stuck in my own mind frame about shit. You did. So I can't, and that what God always tell me to look at. He said, look at, you say, he always said, like, was you that clear minded at 17? Was you that clear minded at 19? So you can't pass, you can't go hard on other, you know, youngins like that and the youth like that. Because the way you didn't really know like that, and you came into the light and start understanding more of me, and then you start having clarity and start using your mind of common sense, and you judge the parts according to your righteousness. You dig what I'm saying? So, I'm just making this video, quick video, wherever you're at in the world, shout out to you. Yeah. Got the homie Cody in this bitch. Yeah. Boss man. For having his own yeah. channel. Own music. You know what I mean? So the rap game, watch out. Y'all seen the last video I post. You already know. Nigga, stay working, bro. You already know. So y'all want to deal with me. Y'all got beats and beat makers and people who do movies and shoot. Whatever. All right. <laughs> Nola16east at gmail.com. Nola16east at gmail.com. It's stupid easy. Nola. You know, LA, the number 16, East, all together, at gmail.com. Because I'm going to do, I don't know if I'm going to do a lot of editing to the video. This is something I'm just dropping for y'all. You did. 
subscribe right now, man. Call you, wake your mom up and you tell your dad it's time to get up for work and tell him to subscribe to my channel, bro. Say, man, hey, look, you got to subscribe to my channel. 2.0, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. You got to get up on this. Because even when you check this video out, there's many other videos that I got you can just check out that you'll love. Even like off the thought, my flame of what these people do these days. So NBA young boy, man, you know what I'm saying? Grow up, King, you know what I'm saying? King ain't about who got the most money. Cause if people got more money than you, somebody can buy you. Straight like that. Right now. Right now. They'll buy your whole catalog. Buy your whole contract, bitch. So that's buying you and put you out of business. So don't think like that, King. So I'm not coming at you like money this and money that, but you know, if you ever seen that movie Blow. I don't know if you've seen it or not. Go watch that movie Blow. And his father told him money ain't real. It's all about assets and investments and things. And making the right decisions. Always making the right decisions and choices. That's why we got it. Long live the homie G money. And condolences go out to his family and the homie Mazi family. That we losing these great brothers out here. But sometimes you live by the soil, you die by it. And nobody can... You know, man can't judge that only he can he only say what time is the right, you know. Things we don't know that we may see a person in their life, but on their background, you know, even you will probably wanna kill him. I don't know. I'm not saying I wanna kill anybody. You no know, young know, kill my comments or oh, keep talking about trap people smoking a cigarette. Yeah, y'all people in them comments kill me, but I love y'all, man. I love y'all cause y'all <laughs> love me. Y'all watching me. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And how many minutes? Oh, shit, man, we into eleven, going on twelve. You did. All uh, right, two more minutes. I'm gonna wrap it up. Listen to that. You did. Boss Scout Live two point oh. Yeah. So to both camps, you know what I'm saying, Young Dolph, Guy, <laughs> NBA Young Boy, and G Money family. I know. I hey, man. Boy, we know. Shit. <laughs> talk hey, to man. Me. Talk to me. Hey, <laughs> we know, bro. Bro, we know. So I ain't nothing I can tell y'all, but. Just, just keep the fight. That shit like, hurt when he hit home, man. Yeah, it, 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 it hurt when he hit home, bro. Yeah, shit. You know what I mean? Somebody's son got took him from him, brother, cousin, probably father. That shit ain't hard to swallow. You know what I'm saying? Something yeah, to tell shit. y'all think rational about things. You know what I'm saying? Because a, a close brother of mine always told me that Satan work in tens. He don't work in ones. If he could get one and he could take 10 and 20 off of that one going, yeah, it's numbers. You know? it's so numbers. y'all think rationally, just like we had to, you know. But that's rational. You did. If you take a life, your life should be taken. People, oh, that sound trapped. Because this is what y'all taught in y'all matrix that murderers could be in prison and live their life freely. Like, come on, man. But you say murderers. <clears throat> I ain't saying killers. Murderers and killers are two different vibes. You dig what I'm saying? Boss got live 2.0. Like, like, light, light, share this video to y'all boys, man. Love and peace to y'all boys. Y'all stop this bullshit, Yo. man. Quit letting these people make all this money off of black I'm faces educated. dying. You dig what I'm saying? Hey, I love you because you love me. Our next um, video is coming right trouble. now. You dig what I'm saying? In three, what you need? Two, one.